Our climate is changing. The world's temperature is rising and weather patterns are acting differently. In the West Midlands, we're going to see warmer, wetter winters, hotter, drier summers and more extreme weather events. These new weather patterns aren't what we're used to in the West Midlands. Unless we adapt and prepare for the incoming changes, our people, our natural environment and all of the systems we depend upon, like transport, healthcare and energy, will be exposed to a number of threats. Changes in rainfall will harm plants and animals and the habitats they live in. More rain can increase flood risks, causing problems for transportation, health services, power supplies and our homes. July 2023 was one of the wettest on UK records. Callouts spiked for the West Midlands Fire Service with over 100 weather-related callouts in one day, including to Wolverhampton's New Cross Hospital. Hotter days make it tougher for some plants and trees to grow and bring an increase in wildfire risk. Hotter days also lead to more demand for water and expose people to heat stress, which can be particularly hard on the elderly, young children and those who are already sick. During the 2022 summer heat waves, England and Wales saw 3,271 excess deaths. Failing to adapt to changing weather will increase the workload of emergency services, damage our properties and disrupt the region's workforces. While it is critical to reduce emissions to limit climate change, we need to better prepare for its impacts. Though these impacts are becoming more and more visible, we still have time to prepare for them. Climate adaptation means making changes to help handle and be better prepared for the potential threats of the changing climate. The goal of adaptation is to help communities, businesses and all of the systems we rely on, like transport, energy and the natural environment, prepare for, withstand and recover quickly from the effects of a changing climate. Adaptation solutions might mean keeping rooms cooler by using blinds, curtains or shutters to cover windows exposed to sunlight, planting the right kind of plants, trees and vegetation that can survive future temperatures, growing plants that provide shading, improve air quality, reduce temperatures and offer a natural solution to collecting rain. Installing water butts in homes to store collected rainwater for later use. Thinking about these questions can help understand how to change behaviours to protect both yourself and your loved ones in times of extreme heat, flooding and other weather-related hazards. Climate adaptation will also mean organisations working together to find and address climate-related risks and help make people, businesses and the systems we rely on become collectively prepared for and resilient against the effects of a changing climate. For more information, visit www.wmca.org.uk forward slash adaptation.